questions from the, from the gentlemen of the press. But I to take your questions. Yes, sir. Can I clip you so that we can have very yes. high quality audio? Yes, sir. Um, now that you have staged this appeal to the state government, what is your next line of action? Is there going to be stoppage of activities on the campus of the Polytechnic Ibado after this uh, First, outing? I'm Dr. Kola Wale Adebayo Lawa. I'm the Chairman of Academic Staff Union of the Polytechnic Ibado. And with me, uh, Chairman of Senior Staff Association of Nigerian Polytechnic, Sani, Mr. Abiodu Abegunde, and I have Mr. Somori. He is the chairman of non-academic staff union of Polytechnic. So these are the three unions within the Polytechnic Ibadan. As we are doing this today, this is going on in other Polytechnics in Oyo State. The same thing is going on in College of Education Lanlate because we are facing the same problem. We are jointly appealing to our governor to look in, our, in the direction of our sector. Today, it is just three-day action to call the attention of the government to our plight. We have written severally. We have given 21 days ultimatum. We have given 14 days ultimatum. We have given 7 days ultimatum. We have given 3 days ultimatum. All this within a space of 114 days. Yes, have you not oh, tried? Yes. I hope that within these 3 days, God will answer. So we believe that if our letter has not been working, mm. let us do this mm. to appeal to him as our father, to appeal to him as our mentor, to appeal to him as a man of the people, to appeal to him as a humanitarian that the polytechnic education in your state is dying. Because the education in your state is dying. If you want to convert everything to university, let's people know that we are having only universities in your state. But the situation of playing second fiddle, our governor should please look into it. It's not fair on our system. So this action today is not a fight. It's not a crisis issue between us and the government. But rather, it's a contact of appeal to our Excellency, Governor Abiyoju Olusha Yimakinde, to please look in our direction and smile. I'm sure that when he's fully aware of our, of our situation, I'm sure he's going to do something. I'm sure he's a man of the people. I'm sure he's a man of quality. I'm sure he's going to look in that direction and do the right thing. And that is why we are, we are appealing today. Sir, the regulator of the Polytechnic Education in Nigeria, National Board for Technical Education, is currently having a national workshop. workshop within the premises of Polytechnic Ibado. Does your action prevent the organizers and the participants in that workshop from participating? We are responsible unions. I will not just behave like uh, garage towers. We are law-abiding citizens. You can see people that want to enter. People that are doing workshops within our campus, we are not stopping them. Once they come, we allow them to enter. Our agitation is not to stop full-fledged activity within our system. So people that are doing their workshop, they are doing their workshop in peace. We are allowing them, we are guiding them in. So there's no problem with programs happening within the Polytechnic Department. Thank you very much, sir. The students, uh, they have a program that they started yesterday and they still want to continue today, but they are unable to proceed now. Yeah, it's unfortunate that uh, this has to happen when they were having a program. But this morning, we have had interaction with the students. We have worked on a middle-level approach to ensure that our program is not totally, totally affected. We have arranged on a movement for them to get to their program. And after this program as well, we still go to ensure that uh, their, program, their, their program is not disturbed. We all have rights. They have rights within the institution, as we have rights. So we are not going to use our own agitation to trample on their rights. No, we are going to help them to do their program, and that will be, not, like I said, we are not, we are not out. We are not out. So the program, we have their program, the student will have their program successfully today. So in a nutshell, there's, going, there's not going to be any uh, academic activity? No academic activity for three days. For three days. No official no, no academic activity for three days. On Monday, we return back to the classroom. On Monday, we return back to administrative functions. And we believe that our government that we know, Within the space of next week, it's going to smile on us. We believe that we'll call you back to come and inform you that our governor to has been so nice and has been We'll call you to government. appreciate our governor for smiling on us. We'll call you to appreciate our governor for doing what we need to do to make this system better. Hey, what's up, what's up, ladies of Nigeria? This is your two sided meeting, Wendy, and I'm here to tell you to keep watching OTV. Thanks for watching OTV.